Whee! Hi everybody, and today I'm talking about Zombie U. Uh, backstabbing Xbox a little bit on this one, with it being a Wii U game. Gameplay in it, they have just thrown you straight in there. There is no tutorials. You go in and you do not have a clue what to expect. Uh, you just get chucked in there, and I think I survived for about 20 seconds before I got mauled to death. And you're thinking, oh, right, okay, so what do I do? Well, the best bit about it, I'm not ruining it for you because it's right at the beginning of the game. Yeah, you get mauled to death within 20 seconds. If you can last longer than that, never playing on it before, uh, all credit where it's due. Uh, in fact, let me know because I want to know what you did because I didn't have a clue. I got stuck on some ladders. Uh, I didn't have a clue how to climb them, obviously, and I got a load of zombies behind me chewing the back of my head. And then, if they pin you down, forget how much health you've got in your health bar. As soon as they've pinned you down, you're dead. You're, you're zombie food. But, the difference, you come back as a different person. You can go back to the place where they died, and they will be there as a zombie. With all the stuff that you've collected in their backpack. So you just, like, kill them, and then rob all your stuff back. That's if someone else hasn't killed them before you. It's not an online game. It does have multiplayer content which I haven't tried but from what I've heard not too impressed about really one person's a zombie the other person's a survivor yet it's only a local player game so it'll be split screen but yeah that'd be the one knockoff point that it doesn't have multiplayer but there's so much more to it you've got the tablet right you get thrown in there, and like many guys, I can't multitask to save my life. There's no way I can stare at a tablet and look at the TV at the same time. Um, so I'm all over the place. I think it's great because you're panicking because the zombies are going to eat you. Great little gadget, the tablet. It's got a motion sensor on there. The only problem is it picks up rats, birds, uh, and it doesn't obviously pick up for when zombies are asleep or stood still. So you could walk around corner still and a zombie be there staring you in the face. Story-wise, yeah, I'm still in the middle of the game, or I would like to think I'm at the beginning or something like that, but apparently the Prime Minister, good old Prime Minister, he's got into a bit of witchcraft and he's turned everyone to zombies, which is quite fresh for a zombie game, I think. But it's brilliant. Um, very eerie, very, very dark hard to see half the time this is another zombie game where you need to loot everything you see bearing in mind you've only got so much space in your backpack and carry it but you need to prioritize bullets are very hard to come by to begin or to begin with uh, you use them very fast because they're quite hard to kill it is headshot kills with these guys uh, you got your trusty cricket bat Shaun of the Dead style. The other day I died, um, not through getting eaten by zombies. For some reason, I think they can smell you. They, these are the types of zombies that can smell human flesh. And there was this zombie on the other side of a door, and just because there's a closed door doesn't mean the zombies can't get through it. They bang and bang and bang on the doors, and you can see all the dust flicking off around it. Uh, so I thought, right, okay, I'll shut the door. And I've got these mines. So I laid a mine down, and all of a sudden, the zombie stopped banging on the door. And I was like, oh, so he ain't going to come round and blow up, which I thought he was going to do. So I went to go pick up a mine that I laid, and turns out you can't pick your own mines up once you've laid them. Yeah, got blown to bits. Uh, I doubt that my corpse is walking around for me to rob all my ammunition and guns that I collected. Which was kind of gutting because I got a crossbow um, and I was yet to use it so I don't know what that was going to be like. The fear, the fear is brought back in this game. A lot of zombie games like your Left 4 Dead, Dead Rising, Call of Duty, it's the fact that, I don't know, they're a lot harder to kill. The fact that it's saying London is a real Brucey bonus. Uh, you got 
I mean, I've just this minute broken out of Buckingham Palace after roaming round it looking for uh, zombie corgis, but there ain't any in there, which was kind of disappointing. But did you know that the Queen had a massive laboratory underneath uh, Buckingham Palace? I didn't know that. Um, yeah, so they were experimenting on zombies. <laughs> Who'd have thought? Queenie. Like, she likes the zombies. She likes a bit of headshots and whatnot. But especially with your mates. You know, see how long you, you survive and pass the controller around. But yeah, shits everyone up every single time. Everybody should go check it out. At least check out some YouTube videos and whatnot. Uh, I'll see you guys later, alligators. Bye.